Florida's news leader. This is Wink News Now at 6. On New Tonight at 6, can President Obama's plan to help homeowners refinance their mortgage help you? The president announced last night that he'll send legislation to offer government-backed low interest rates to homeowners. But some Republicans are already calling it dead on arrival. Ryan Kruger is here now with more. Chris, the legislation focuses on homeowners who have been unable to get their lenders to lower their interest rates. President Obama says his plan means no more red tape and no more runaround from the banks. If you're worried about losing your home, 3000 bucks could go a long way to calm your fears. The White House has not yet released a full mortgage assistance plan, but local real estate attorney Kevin Jerzinski estimates the average homeowner could refinance with as much as a 2% drop in interest, saving you nearly 250 bucks a month. I think the idea has some merit if the lenders get what they want. Jerzinski says that would be more government assurance, adding that many banks have been hesitant toward refinancing rates when they're already losing money on the loan. If the government comes in and says, look, we want to help you out here, we'll give you some type of protection for taking less per year, but we'll give you some insurance on the back end. We'll We'll subsidize this, we'll, we'll, we'll do some government backing. Administration officials hope homeowners will use the $3,000 they get back to put into the economy and help stabilize the housing market. If someone is underwater in their house, they may there's more of an incentive for them to walk away from it. So that may stabilize the market and stop some of the people who are strategically defaulting. The president did not elaborate on his plans, only saying that a small fee would be applied to the nation's largest financial institutions. Of course, anything he tries needs congressional approval, and a tax increase on banks will be difficult to pass.